It's more than a year until Illinois' gubernatorial election, but several Republicans want their party's nomination. That includes current state senator Darren Bailey. He represents parts of the Wabash Valley in the Illinois Senate. Bailey joins former state senator Paul Schimpf and businessman Gary Rabine in the Republican race. Zeke Torres spoke with Bailey about what he'd like to see done in his state. Zeke now joins us with more. Zeke. Dana, from representative of from Representative to State Senator of the 55th District, Darren Bailey has been vocal on why he thinks he should be the next governor of Illinois. I sat down with Bailey to hear what he has to say on the current state of Illinois and, if elected, how he would change it. A farmer, a former 17-year North Clay School Board member, state representative, and current state senator, Darren Bailey pursues a new goal becoming the 44th governor of Illinois. I think that when people began to uh, meet me and get to know me, uh, the sincerity is real. Uh, people, uh, we, we, we travel with people when we go to places that have been with us for a long time. They vouch for this guy's who he said, it, you know, he is. In his current campaign, Bailey says one of his top priorities is to get a handle on the state's finances. I have proposed a zero-based budget. Uh, absolutely spending freeze, no tax increases, and then every department would start at zero, you know, and, and begin to build as, as they would have to show and prove why they need this money. As the COVID-19 pandemic continues, Bailey has been critical of Governor J.B. Pritzker's phased reopen Illinois plan. The economy has been decimated. Children are hurting. Senior, senior citizens in long-term care are frustrated because there's been no visitation rights, there's been no social activity, and uh, we've taken a toll because of that. You let each county determine what the health department needs to do. We, we, we're in, we live in a free society here. We are Americans. We're smart. We're, we're people of common sense. Uh, we figure this out, and we do ultimately what is right. Bailey said he would also evaluate bills already signed into law, including a police reform bill Pritzker signed, one that Bailey has spoken against. The newly signed law includes regulating officer body cameras by 2025, officers completing de-escalation training, and eliminating cash bail. With a year and a half left until the election, Bailey says he feels confident. When we figure this out under, under you know, my governorship, uh, Illinois is going to be a great state, and I believe that will emulate all across this uh, nation. I truly believe that. Senator Bailey and I discussed a variety of topics ranging from the Illinois pension to gun control. To see more on this interview, you can visit our website, mywabashvalley.com. Mike. All right, thank you, Zeke.